Kofi, welcome to Point Blank. Thank you, bro. Yes, we knew you as the Independent People's Party flag bearer or leader. Um, now we, we hear you are, I mean, the last election you contested as the LPG uh, presidential candidate. Why did you change from IPP to LPG? Oh, uh, we changed the name from IPP to LPG in 2017. Mm. Uh, we realized that people were confused with the word independent. Mm. So instead of uh, relating us as an uh, independent uh, political party, mm. you're rather referring to us as an uh, independent candidate, independent mm. candidate. So, and also we are a member of the Libra International. Mm. So to for people to know where we are coming from and our geological uh, standing, that is why we decided to change them to the Libra International. So the Adolika, and then the LPG really is also like liquefied petroleum gas. Okay. So, so why do you change from one IPP independent or independent party or, or power producer <laughs> to LPG, all in the energy sector. Yeah, it means we... We, 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 we are believe, strong on energy. Yeah, we believe in that one. <laughs> we believe in the power. So what what, what, what then is the ideology that, that you, you profess? What, what What's your standing? What's your view on things? What ideological position do you espouse? Uh, we are uh, promoting liberalism. Mm. And uh, we want to fill the gap uh, between the MPP and the NDC. You know, MPP is on the right and NDC is on the left. Uh, Socialist International and then Democratic Union. Mm. So we are the Libra International. We mm. are in the middle and our main focus is on fundamental human rights and uh, also uh, supporting uh, uh, ent uh, free enterprise and mm. uh, also supporting small taxes uh, or lower taxes and uh, helping uh, those in the lower class to join the middle class. But how, how, how we different, are in for the middle class. How, how different are, are these from what the NDC and MPP have been doing? Of course, they, they claim to be to be, to be be uh, on the right or center of right, center of left, etc. But they eventually do the same thing. So uh, how different is, 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 I mean, they do the same thing. So how different will you be? Yeah, really? because they are confused because they are not following their ideological uh, lineage. It's just that they are trying to pick everything from everywhere. Mm. Uh, because... Those are the uh, the MPP. They are supposed to focus on uh, the the top, the business class. Yeah, the top notch. Uh, you know, it's but, 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 but they say that they are for the middle class. They are for business. No, they are not for the middle class. Yeah, the, those who are for the liberals are mm -hmm. they for the middle class. We are mm -hmm. the middle class. We mm -hmm. are the middle class party, the centrist party. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I see, but, but they, they claim that they, they are also the, the party of businesses against this party for, for the middle class. The NDC yeah. also says yeah. things like that. Okay. But, but you know, uh, um, do ideologies really work in, in our politics? That, that It doesn't matter which ideological position you espouse. Uh, it matters. It mm. matters because uh, people joining your party should know where you are taking them to. Mm. Only that some people, they join political party without knowing uh, what the political party is all about, you know. Mm. So... Uh, that's another issue. But uh, going forward, I can see that Ghana, we are changing. Ghana, we are getting to understand uh, even issues. Before, we were not even cent uh, centering on uh, issues. We were just saying anything, anyhow, you know. But this time, especially in the twenty, the last 2016, 2016, 2020 elections, you could see we were espousing uh, issues, policies, direction, what uh, one would do. Uh, when he's given the opportunity to serve the country. Mm. And uh, people more or less voted based on that. Mm. So I believe going forward, people begin to understand that, hey, why should I vote for this guy? Why should I vote for this party? You would not just wake up in the morning and just go and vote. Mm. You would think twice and then analyze everybody's uh, plans and policies and programs before you go and cast your vote. But do you think, um, maybe I call you the minority parties or the smaller parties, do you think you guys are doing enough to, to win the hearts and minds of the people? Because people say they are tired of NDC, MPP, but in the end, they are the same people they go for, which perhaps means that you guys are not doing enough to, to build confidence in the people. The people don't see you as, as any alternative any serious alternative for them to even go vote for you. So, so, so we, 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 we still get this NDC, MPP top heavy and then we just throw in a few votes for you guys. No, the problem is with the media. Mm. The problem is the media because the media focus more on MPP and NDC mm. uh, noise. You know, mm. I will not say uh, I, uh, ideals or whatever. It's about their noise. Mm. Uh, who is making loud noise? And then they will just uh, 
be following and then you'll be right. But if you if you if you put out credible policy alternatives, the media will talk to you. If if you espouse, you know, certain credible policies, I mean alternative no, policies the, which, the, which which are good, the media the is media not, will, will, will follow the, you. the media is not really uh, focusing on uh, people's ideas and uh, programs. Hmm. They are rather focusing on who can insult well, really? uh, who can uh, uh, attack somebody's personality and stuff like that. In the last election, the media focused on the issues. One day street, one factory. I mean, yeah. the, the, the big push, uh, um, um, free SHS, you know, yeah. a whole lot. These are issues. Yeah. But we didn't really hear anything major from the LPG, for example. Oh, but you were in the race as well. Yeah, but LPG, we were talking about uh, putting money directly into people's pocket. How? Direct uh, transfers? Yeah. You do them yeah, cash? Direct. Oh, yes. You, you uh, go meet them child. some. But they do that under leap. Yeah. No, that's that's uh, non-starter. You know, we, we have to be serious because you can't just give somebody ATCDs and thinking the person can use ATCDs to do anything. But where will you yeah. get the money from? I mean, how, yeah. how are you going to get money and put it in people's pockets? Yeah, you have to create money. You have to create money. You know, money, we create them. We don't inherit money, we create money. So, how? Oh, I mean, there's so many things that you can do to create money. Uh, I believe that when you pump money into the system, mm. you have the economy to grow. Uh, you have to stimulate the economy. Mm -hmm. You know, 2009, when Obama became president of the United States, you know what he did? Mm. He pumped money into the system. He stimulated the economy mm -hmm. because everything was down, you know? So you can't run an economy thinking that money will just grow. Organically, but, but we, we, don't, we don't have the money. We've gone to IMF for, for a bailout. Where are we going to get the money to pop into the system? Just right. like no, well, we don't need we don't need dollars to pump into the system before the system works. You, you print it, money. You print it. Oh, money! There, yeah, we have so many ways to print money. Mm. You don't necessarily need to print uh, the currency. Mm. You know, you can create accounts. You can create an account ledger. Ledger can work for you mm. because sometimes I don't even understand why a contractor will do a project and you're supposed to pay the project and you are not paying, and you are leaving the, the contractor to be struggling in this, uh, uh, I mean, in that situation. To me, it's not the best. It doesn't help the economy to grow. It doesn't create jobs, it doesn't sustain jobs, and we need to start thinking. How, how will you do the ledger thing? I'm interested. How, how, will, you, how will you create it? How, how will you do, do that? The ledger, you create it, and you create the account, and how, how will it work? Yeah, you see, as an accountant, uh, mm -hmm. that, that's how I see You manufacture it. the zeros. Oh, no, for manufacturing the zeros. You know, you see, the central bank, for instance, how much do we owe all the contractors in this country? If you mm. owe them, say, 10 billion cities, mm. it, it, it's a debt mm -hmm. that the government have to service, pay the contractors, for the contractors to go back to work, pay and sustain their businesses. Mm. So what do you do? Whether you like it or you're going to pay. Okay. So why don't you consolidate them? Mm. Give it to the central bank, okay? Borrow the money and then take your time to pay the central bank. Mm. So that you can pay your contractors, and your contractors will go back to field and start working. But it's not like they, it's a it's a one off. So that will be contractors. They will go back and work, and you incur you, uh, you incur then, other then, debts. Then, then why do you give them uh, uh, the projects in the first place? If you know you are not going to pay, why do you give them the projects? Mm. So you shouldn't give them the projects. But if you know that the projects are necessary, and then you give them, you have to find a way to pay them. Mm. So you create, you consolidate everything. You give it to them, and then you take your time. You can come uh, a payment to one person, mm. and that is the, the central bank. And you take your time to pay them, you work and pay. Mm. Now, these businesses will be in operation. They will sustain jobs. They will, uh, the, uh, the economy will be growing. You know, when you put a dollar in an economy, mm. it has to revolve 27 times. But when you stop putting money, the, the whole economy will start, and uh, there won't be any jobs created. Mm. And even those that have been created will collapse. By here, because we don't pay unemployment benefit, when we are destroying people's business, we don't give a damn, we don't care because there's no obligation in the state to pay unemployment benefit. But where we have that obligation, that knowing that mm, if you don't, uh, don't sustain jobs, the burden will be on you. You will be careful. Especially mm. somebody can just wake up in the morning and just open his mouth and say, oh, don't patronize this product, don't do this business with this person, don't do that, you know, without thinking that those businesses will collapse, you know, but because you don't have the obligation. I've been following the, the Bank of Ghana issues. I mean, the, the annual report and all of that, the losses they posted, et cetera, and, and the political discussion that, that has, you know, come there from. NDC saying that they given the governor and his deputies 21 days to uh, to resign, else they will occupy the, the BOG premises, et cetera. Have you been following that discussion generally? What do you make of the, the losses posted by the 
uh, the, the central bank? Oh, it's just uh, uh, share noise, you know, <laughs> just making noise. Which people? Uh, the NDC people, mm. you know, they're just making noise, you know, because uh, it's a, a joke of the century, you know. Mm. <laughs> that like, a central bank governor will resign? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Why he cannot resign? No, he's posted no. such, such huge losses, about 60 billion. 60, that's 6 billion dollars. Yeah, but that's, that, that's 60 billion of Ghana's yeah. currency. We no, don't, no, we, we've gone to IMF for 3 billion. No, that's, and if it's cost the country $6 billion, yeah, that's a lot of money. Yeah, $6 billion. So that's a lot of yeah, money. Yeah, it's a lot of money. But mm -hmm. And he to, cannot resign because no. it's, it's... Why do, it's why do you want losses? him to resign? Why do you want him to resign? Because is that the only central bank that has incurred losses in the 2022? Check. Yes, a Swiss bank. Mm. They incurred $143 billion. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, United States. No, no, but we are not the Swiss. We are not. No, I know uh, the next example no, you I'm, give is, is the Bank of England. You, I'm giving but, you. But we are not in the same league. No, no, no. So, so tell me about Benin. Yeah, tell me about Nigeria. No, I'm coming. Tell me about Kenya. Tell me I'm about Ethiopia. There. Then I'm, we can have a conversation. No, I'm coming there. Mm -hmm. I'm coming there. You know, Singapore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they reported twenty-three billion dollars. Mm -hmm. uh, Sweden. Mm -hmm. They reported seven billion. Okay, mm -hmm. losses. With all their technology and everything, their efficiency and everything, if they are able to report, let's say, one of the three billion dollars, mm. uh, Swiss central bank, then it means uh, it's not news. Here mm. in Ghana, we've reported six billion dollar uh, equivalent uh, losses. So, but the size now, of the now, economy, now, the size of our economy is smaller. No, no, and, no, and no, no. What has contributed to that? Mm. That's, contributed to that. That's a, a write-off of a government debt. Mm. I mean, if, if if you owe yourself money, you, you, what is you, news you, about that? You give government money and later you say you, you've written it uh, off. So and, and indeed, the conversation really too has been about the involvement or otherwise of parliament. Parliament should be involved or informed about this write-off. Yeah. You don't do it. You just sit in your office and you say you've written it off. No, it, it, the government cannot pay. Because no, but, but there's due process. Yeah, I mean, there's a reason why we have the laws and the rules. Yeah. You know, they, so they, they, I don't, they, I don't they, think they, there's any anywhere they no, but, are faulted. But, but, but if they've broken the rules no, or no, they've breached they the, they the rules, if they've breached the rules, that's we, we an issue. We need to know the law that they've faulted. Yes. Like, like the deficit law. financing, for example, no, 5% no. of the previous year's revenue. Yeah, they've no. gone way past but, that. But, but this debt that you're talking about, do you know how long it has been in the books? No, but this was just 2022. Because before you write it's 2022. You know, city, 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 Business city, FM city, whatever. You know, they write off uh, bad debt. No, but, 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 yes, but, but, no, but this is different. Do, this is just last year. No, and if, no. Let's even talk about the operational. No, no. Let's even talk about the, the, the operational expenses they incurred. No, no. You see, but the bad debt they wrote off wasn't like they, were, they incurred a debt in last year and then they wrote them off. It has been the boost for long. And mm. then they have to write them off. Let, let, let's even talk about the, 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 operational, the operational issues. So, for example, spending over 190 million uh -huh. on, on car maintenance. That, that, that's a prudent see, use of resources. You, you see, that's, that's another problem. That's a prudent use of no, resources. No, that's another problem. Spending 90 million I, I, on me, travels. Uh, no, as, as an accountant, let me tell you something. You see, we easily open and then criticize and condemn people. Mm. But I don't do I don't do that kind of politics. Mm. You see, but it, you, it's I'm, easier I'm for coming, it's easier for you to criticize the NDC. Cars, you, no, no. How many than, cars than do they have? Criticize the government. Really. No, no. How many cars do they have? We have to find first check. Mm. How many cars do they have? Mm. And who and who are they paying their car maintenance? Mm. What what is involved in the car maintenance? Mm. You see, but, but, but is that you kind see, of expenditure reflective no, just of the and, mood of the country, exactly. of the financial position no, 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 of the country? No, no, no. Is, no, is no, that no. reflective? No, no. When you come to CTFM, mm. maybe they will hear your voice, they will hear, uh, what is my, my uh, Bernard. Bernard, yeah. And uh, they will hear this, they will hear that they think they are the only people working. Even right now, as we are talking, mm. people will think that it's just between me and you. Mm. But there are just, there another gentleman beside you. Mm. There are other producers in there who mm. are also helping you to get your job done. Mm -hmm. So some tomorrow, your company reports that, oh, they are paying salary this amount. Somebody will say somewhere, hey, why is CTFM spending that kind of money? Without the person going first to know who and who are involved. So, so you, you see, think that those expenses no, were no, justified? It's, it's, it's justified because- it's you, Huge sums of money like that on no, travels. No, no, until, until you go in there to know what constitutes that. Other than that, you can just wake up somewhere and condemn people just like that. You 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 are, you have lived in in the Ashanti Kumasi for a very long time. Yeah. I mean, before you came, in, I'm sure you heard the news about the tricycle operators, etc. The 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 KMA and the police trying to get them off 
uh, um, the central business district because they say they cause the congestion, etc. What's your thinking around that? Young people who want jobs using tricycles, you know, and you are getting them on the street. What was your thinking around that? No, to me, that's not the kind of job we should, we should create for these young people. Yeah, but we've not been we able are, to create a job. Yes, so, so what was your blueprint? That's why we need to change. What was your, what's your blueprint? What's the LPG parties, you know, blueprint for job creation? I mean, reducing poverty, etc. I believe that uh, we need to understand that every young man out there, mm-hmm. one or the other, possesses some vision. Mm. Because when you go to the good book, that's uh, uh, Joel chapter 2, mm-hmm. verse 28. Mm-hmm. He says, in the latter day, I will pour my spirit on all flesh. Mm. Your young people will see visions. Your old men shall dream dreams. Exactly. So if the young people are going to have visions, then we, the leaders of this country, should sit down and think mm-hmm. that we have to provide them the needed support for them to realize their visions. Mm. So we should make that provision for them. And uh, when you go to the same Bible, Deuteronomy no, uh, Proverbs chapter 29, verse 18. Mm. It says, lack of vision, the people perish. Mm. So meaning that we are where we are because we don't have the vision. Or we have the vision, but we don't get any support. Mm. But when you, uh, just suppose that to say America, yeah, you realize that in America, they call that place land of opportunities. Mm. Why do they call land of opportunities? Because when you have a vision, they will support your vision. This computer here on my left is their computer. Mm-hmm. The guy who started this business was a young man, 19 years, mm-hmm. Michael Dell. He started this, he got the needed support, and he built it. The operating system working in there is Microsoft operating system. The guy started at the age of 19. He got the needed support, and he built it. Even your phone that you are using, that is the iPhone, Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak, they came together to build Wozniak was 24 years, and Steve Jobs was 19 years. They, do, they did that. And then uh, this guy was Larry Page. Mm. And we all go in and say, we are Googling for something. We want to get information. Instead of saying, we are searching for something, you say, oh, Google it for me. Google, the guy who did that, or Gmail, mm. Larry Page, was at the age of what, 21. So the, so the point is that what? The point is that we have neglected our young people. Instead of bringing our young people together, understand their vision, and support them. And vision. now they found a job for themselves riding no, tricycles. This, this is this They must put body and soul together. No, no, These this, are bread and butter matters. Exactly. They, they must that is feed. why LPD is going to do something different. Like we are what? going to make sure if you are not working, we pay you unemployment benefits. We support you with income to make sure we, we give you sustainable income. How are you going and to do that? You create accounts and create ledgers, like you said uh, earlier before. But how do you run an economy? Hmm. Do you, are you happy to make laws in your boots and then you are sitting there and you are hungry? Hmm. You know, that's the kind of uh, the black man mentality. They, they just wake up in the morning, go and sit in the parliament. They say they are making laws. They make laws and then the, the laws will just entangle them. And then they are suffering. Mm. You know, the first, this is why people that we are learning from, okay, they don't make that, that kind of laws. So they mm. make laws and make sure that they protect the people. So the people must eat. So mm. man must eat. Yes. So we need to create an environment mm. such that the young people here can make it and prosper here. You know, you have diamond, you have bauxite. Mm. You don't add value to the bauxite. Look at this. This here mm. is a bauxite. Mm. What are we doing? Have you built a bauxite refinery for all these years? We no. said we'll build it, but we've not built it. Yeah. When I become president, I will do it. Mm. Because I think, I don't see why but we it's, 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 Talk is cheap. You know, no, that's, that's, that's a problem about men and other no. facing now because they said a lot of things prior to, I mean, no, no, before no. 2016 the, 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 and, and it's become difficult in implementing no, no. a lot we, of we, them. Remember in your class, mm. when you were in secondary school or primary school, something mm. like that, you know, you were about 14 in the class. Mm-hmm. But when the results came, mm-hmm. I mean, one was first, one was last. Mm-hmm. So... We are not thinking the same way. So, so in, in, in your, in your class, you will be first, and Nado and Bamiya will be last. Is that yeah, I'll be first because I believe that I should be able to add value to. Mm. Why should we import rice to this country? Why mm. should we import poultry to this country? Why should we import maize, onion, and all those kind of stuff? Why should mm. we import them? Even clothing. Why should we import clothing? Why should mm. we import shoes? I mean, on, on some governance issues. I mean, re, I mean, before even today, before you came in, I mean, we, we heard the news about the office of the special prosecutor freezing. Some assets of Cecilia Dapa. What was your, what's your thinking around the whole Cecilia Dapa scandal? Um, I, actually, I don't know uh, what is going on there because if they froze in her accounts, uh, why? It's, it's, it's their business. They are uh, protecting the assets mm. of this country. So if they believe that maybe he has gotten some a world, mm. it's I mean, who am I to challenge them? So, so, so you support the ongoing, you know, investigation into, yeah, into the lifestyle. Yeah, they have to investigate everybody. So you don't support the fact you're an accountant with money. You don't support the fact that it was proper for for her to to keep those 
huge sums of money she kept in the house before the yeah the because house was because of the system that we operate here mm. the system that we operate here it encourages people to keep money in the house how yeah because we go to the bank you deposit your money and then they re, they report you uh, Mr. Palu just deposited this kind of money in the account you know what what is that mm. Maybe I'm not sure that your salary or the jobs you do ah. could get get you that money. Why shouldn't no, they be no, concerned? No, no, no. Why should that be their problem? No, no. But we should know. If you are a public figure, you you are, you are working. Uh, we are paying you, and now you you you, you are, come depose no. a lot of money. We we have to find out where the money is from because we do not pay you that much. And then you go and put money in, then they, then they report you. Yes, I mean I'm, yeah. I'm I don't work. I'm not a public server. I don't work for the, the state. Doesn't pay me. I pay the state officials. Yeah, no, everybody. Including you, because you cannot, they cannot, you cannot say only the public figure. No, what, what, what I, I mean can is, give my what, money to you. No, what, what I what I mean I is, I can what, put my money in your name. Know, what, I, what I mean is, when a public official holds money, no, it beyond, be only public official holds money beyond yeah. you know what the state pays a person, uh -huh. it should raise eyebrows. That's the point I'm making. Um, to me, yeah, we know you go. We, we went to Europe and we learned Basel three and Basel mm -hmm. two and mm -hmm. whatever, and mm -hmm. we think we're implementing them. Mm -hmm. Okay, but every day, drugs move to United States. Hmm. All they are sophisticated, whatever. Still, drugs goes to United States. Hmm. So, we don't jump. We are jumping too much in this How? country. We yeah, should be we, doing bad things. No, no bad things. We are running too much. So what should we do? We yeah, should be walking. We have to take time and sit down and reflect. Which means what? Ah, you don't, you don't, you don't just go and pick something else. You are just doing it. My brother. To the bus of two and three and things. Uh, they just go and uh, so they, are, they are doing it. <laughs> so no, let, let, just tell me about uh, LPG. You, you will still be the the, the 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 flag bearer. Yes, I'm going to. Are you a flag bearer for life or something? Nobody, oh, no, con no, no. nobody contests you. Oh, no, somebody is contesting me. Somebody you have planted there to contest you, so there's oh, a semblance no, no. of democracy in your party. No, no, no. It's a political party. Mm. The, I don't because you are, you are, it's like you are the face of the party. You are the alpha and omega yeah, the, of the party. No, the Rollins started uh, NDC. So you have so, you have national executives who oh work. Oh yes, we do. We mm. do have national executives. We have our uh, your, your uh, office at Kokorome is your national office, right? Yeah, it does and it's, it. it's functional. It works. Yeah, it works every day. Every day when you except weekends, mm. we are there all the time. So you can pop in one of these days and see. Mm. We are a serious political party. Mm. We are not like the rest. We are when sick. are you going for your Congress to elect your national executives and uh, then your parliament? Yeah, that will be next that? year. Next year. Yeah, because the one we did was uh, in July 2020. Mm. Uh -huh. So we are going. Uh, next one will be March mm. uh, 2020. Mm. 2024, sorry. Mm. So the key message you are leaving with the youth of the country is that when they vote for you, or if they vote for you and you come, you will put money in their pocket. You will put direct money in their pocket. Direct. Exactly. Every child below 18 years will receive child benefit. Mm. And then those above 18 years will receive unemployment benefit. Those who are not working. We, are, we want to put And you continue in. with the free SHS? Why not? And, and in the form it says, or you do something about it? Uh, in fact, what we're going to do is we're going to merge the JHS and the SHS together mm. to become one school. But that's what this minister is trying to do. The education minister is trying okay, to do. Okay, I don't know, but we are going to. Merge. You don't. You don't follow. You don't follow trends. You want no, to be I, president. No, I, you don't I, follow no, trends. No, no, I've not heard anything, mm. so okay. I don't waste energy. Mm. So we are going to uh, merge the JHS and the SHS mm. to become. Uh, one school, mm. such that we turn them into day schools. Mm. Okay. Oh, no, no body again. No, no, no body. Really? No body. But what, what, what is the use of body school? To bring national cohesion. Ah, who told you body school bring national cohesion? Those were uh, uh, the days, not today. Today mm. we don't need it. I because see. Because we are living among ourselves. We have North Ness in Accra. We have Everest in Accra. We have everybody in Accra. Are you and Everman, you were in Ashanti region for a long exactly. time. Exactly. I see. Uh -huh. Very well. So, so thank you. We've run out of time. It's been, it's been exciting speaking to you. Uh, um, unless you have some final words. Oh, that, what, what I would say is that mm. everybody, including you, mm -hmm. should vote for me. Mm -hmm. So that we change MPP and NDC. We mm -hmm. throw them away. But people think you are pro-MPP. No, I'm not. You see, me, I, uh, I don't do uh, satanic politics. Mm. You know, I do angelic politics. Mm. You know, satanic politics whereby the witchcraft politics, mm. where you are always wishing uh, the government in power... Uh, evil. Evil. No, mm. I don't do that kind of politics. I see. All right. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Kofi Apalu, presidential. Are you presidential candidate or founder of... Of, uh, of, and, and, and anyone that you call me, uh, okay. uh, founder and presidential candidate of and the, the next president of and, Ghana. And the next president of Ghana, he says, uh, of the LPG.